Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back. Phil. Sam. Bars and Barbells, your favorite reaction channel because we always drop bangers from the Wish Bus. Always got bangers from the Wish Bus. Because the Wish Bus has a lot of bangers. It does. It really does. So this was a recommendation from those comments of somebody that we didn't even know has been on the Wish Bus because we yeah. don't know who they are. Yeah, in Michael Pangalinan. Hopefully I've said that correctly. And uh, fingers crossed. Yes, and uh, so this is somebody I believe that's a Filipino singer, cool. um, and uh, we've got exposed to to some people on the Wish Bus thus far. We've done Marcelito, we've done Morissette, we've done Darren Espanto. Yeah. So if they you're interested, all fire. Yeah, they, it's been really, really great to be introduced to those artists because we never would have come across them if we hadn't been doing this reaction channel and, uh, you know, from your suggestions as well. So we really appreciate all that. We really appreciate being exposed and cultured to these new dynamic artists. And uh, so if you haven't seen those videos, we definitely encourage you to do that. You yes. know, they're they're a part of our favorites for sure. Every time oh, yeah. you know, we do them, like you said, we get blown away. So um, so this will be something different from us. We for us. We haven't heard Michael yet. Uh, but he's going to do Perfect, which is an Ed Sheeran song. And I'm um, excited to see what it's all about. Yeah, let's do it. All right, let's go. <laughs> Got a full band here. Yeah, it's a busy bus. Seven, five. For me, darling, just dive right in and follow my lead. I found a girl beautiful and sweet. I never knew you were that someone waiting for me. We were just kids when we fell in love Not knowing what it was I will not give you up this time Darling, just kiss me slow Your heart is all I so far i feel like he's really good it's definitely different mm -hmm. than the original version it's more of an acoustic but yeah, yeah yeah for sure but i think he's doing a really great job with it and he's he sounds incredible yeah he's got a fantastic voice it's it's um like you said a little more acoustic Lacey's he seems to have maybe an r&b influence in some way yeah, um I can see that. he's got that kind of a style so ed sheeran does a little bit as well but i think he's putting more emphasis on yeah that. i feel like ed sheeran is more of a 
pop then. Yeah, it's it's R and B. Yeah, me. he's definitely still got a lot of you know I think yeah. influence this similarly, but his for me Michael's doing more of an R and B yes. style. Yes, I agree. Um, and uh, he sounds great though. He's got such a soulful voice, mm -hmm. uh, a lot of passion that he's bringing in this one as well. Yeah. It looks like he's having a great time. It looks like he's really enjoying singing the song. Yeah. You know, one thing we always mentioned about the Wish Bus as well is that you know doing this in one take. Oh you yeah, know, every time hitting these notes, and being able to go through it without taking a break and, and, and doing it, it so fantastically with so crisp clarity. Um, great to see the instrumentation as well. We just heard the bass coming in, yeah. which is cool, adding another layer to it. Um, and, uh, you know, I seen the guy in the back there that's playing the other instrument. He was... Um, like mimicking the lyrics as as Michael was singing them, he was like singing it himself. So that was cool to see because you don't often see other band members. Yeah, or group members I love that. Do that's that. cute. And uh, I didn't see that. They've all you know got their like black outfits on yeah. here and everything. That's so that's a cool visual Aww. to see as well. And they all look like they're relatively young guys. So oh yeah, yeah for sure. So really, you know, pow kudos to them and and um, great composition I think as well. But doing this song justice, very very much so. 100 percent. I think that he, the way that he's doing the song is is it sounds awesome and like you said it is a lot more of an R&B vibe I would agree with that um, and more acoustic but I feel like the way that he's bringing the change in the pitch and stuff is it still brings a lot of passion to the performance yeah it's a beautiful performance in general yeah. he's got a really great voice and he's doing a beautiful yes. job with this so we'll let him take us out for the next couple of minutes here yeah. are still kids but oh, we're so in love fighting again will be all right this time darling just hold my hand be my girl i'll be your man i see my future in your eyes With you between my arms Barefoot on the grass Listening to our favorite song When I saw you in the dress Looking so beautiful I don't deserve this Nothing you Between my arms, barefoot on the grass, listening to our favorite song, dancing in the dark. Between my arms, barefoot on the grass, listening to our favorite song. I have faded what I see, now I know. I with all of them at the end yeah it was it was cool how they you know uh, they were able adding in energy taking out energy mm -hmm. throughout to add some different layering in it so that was really cool and like you said when they kind of went in with uh, their <laughs> harmony and everything yeah. it was really nice it. to see so it was an enjoyable performance i liked it overall i think great job mm -hmm. you know just kind of uh piggybacking on what we said in the middle there i think you know he did an outstanding job really um great talent sounds like and um i'm sure he's got i, I would imagine if i had to guess 
that he has R&B songs. That's, that's, that's what he yeah, does. Yeah, I definitely get it, Bob. Especially after you pointed that out. I was like, yes, that's exactly what that sounds like. Yeah, I mean, it was a great rendition of a great version yeah, of I it, really right? Yeah, I really liked it a lot. It's obviously a great song already. You know, it's a banger in mm-hmm. terms of Ed Sheeran Super making it a, a popular song. Yeah. So it's, it's, you know, tough to make your own rendition or a, own version of something and do it well when it's that popular and still, you know, have appeal. And clearly... He has done that, so um, yeah. I, I think especially too when you're not just trying to replicate the original, you're trying to like yes. add your own flavor, bit of a spin on it too, yeah. right? And I think um, the comment that I recommended that we do this was also mentioning that he is one of the most popular um, artists that have come on the Wish Bus, which is mm-hmm. amazing to know because we've done Marcelito and Marisset, and they are super popular yes. in their own right. So uh, yeah. the fact that he's the the one that's got I don't know if it's the most YouTube views or something like that, but um, it's pretty remarkable. So yeah. Um, wow, it's awesome. You can let us know in those comments how he's been doing with his career yeah. and where he's kind of gone from from this performance and what other stuff he might have that you think we should check out. Mm-hmm. You can always leave it in those comments. If you enjoyed our reaction, please hit that like button yes. for us. It really helps with the channel engagement and all that good stuff with the algorithm. So uh, we would appreciate that. And if you would like to, you can hit that subscribe button and come along for this journey that we're on. All right, that's it from us. We'll be back soon. See you guys in the next one.